was uh, uh, Board of Equalization Tuesday, June 13, 2023, meeting to order. First item is uh, roll call. Uh, Mr. Brett Down. Uh, here. Miss Eleanor Thompson. Present. And I'm Patrick Crawley, and I'm here. Uh, no. <laughs> Notice that the meeting was properly posted Wednesday, yeah, or well, whatever it was. Uh, we got four properties on the agenda today. The first one, they're all going to be by phone. So we'll, uh, it looks like they're all ARMM Asset Company, which turns out to be Sam Juan or Mercy. Yes, this is going to be Mercy Galindo again. I'll give her a call. Apologies. Oh, Let's try to get her number here again. Let me see if they've got another number. Let's try this one instead. Looks like it's what, like 8 o'clock there in Florida? Or she's in Florida, right? Yeah, yeah. it's Miami. Oh, it's Miami. Yeah. Yeah. That's true. Yeah, they're ahead. She answered yesterday. Yeah. yeah. Oh, no problem with Miami. There she goes. Thanks, Miami. Good morning, this is Mercy. How can I help you? Yeah, Mercy, this is Patrick Crawley. Chairman of the Board of Equalization in Oklahoma County. We have uh, four of your properties on the board on the agenda today. Are you ready? Yes. Okay. I am. Are you? No. <laughs> I'm <never ready. laughs> I see that. I bet. I bet you're trouble. <laughs> <laughs> How does she know? Okay. First, first one we got is B O E number one hundred six. And the account number ending in 1620 is the property at 1113 Woodcrest in Midwest City. Uh, the, let's see, we've got 1136 square feet is what I show, and the assessor is assessed the value of 140,500, and you're mm -hmm. you're requesting 125,000. Am I correct? Correct. Okay. All right, well tell us what you want us to know about this property. Yes, so this was a multi-sale property. A what? Multi-sale. Uh, a multi-sale. Oh, okay. Multi-parcel sale. I got you. Not a multi-sale, sorry. Um, so yes, that's just, we're doing it based off of the acquisition price that our client had noted on what it was based off of the whole portfolio that they had purchased. Um, so we're just requesting it based off of that sales price. Okay, how many parcels are in that multi-sale? Do you have that info? Uh, let me check. Hold on one second. Um, that's three. Four, two, three. Four. Sorry. Four. Okay. Or, yeah, four. There's four. All right. What? When was that uh, sale? Yeah. When was the sale? Twenty-two. Uh, the sale was in March of twenty twenty-two. Okay, and we got four properties. Uh, and what was mm -hmm. the what was the purchase price? 
Are the other three on the docket today? Do you know? Uh, I don't know. Okay. Uh, let me check. Actually, let me see real quick. Um, one. No, they're they're different. Okay. They are not. All right. Well, I was all up just wondering because it'd be easier if indeed it, indeed it, they were it, because we take four properties uh, get the total square footage and then divide it by that and get the price per square foot and then match out to each yeah. of the property well I took I took the sale price and divided that by four to get an average of two hundred and six thousand eight seventy five so all right well tell us what you want to know about this property that's all it's a rental yes they're they're going to be always rentals okay sorry yeah no uh, it's okay you didn't know that I... you don't have the rent information right you know what if i had clients that would provide it i would but i don't okay <laughs> <laughs> okay uh we'll hear from the assessor if you, that's all you got <clears throat> okay of course okay uh this is located off of uh, the major streets are Sooner and Reno, as you see there. Uh, as you stated earlier, our current value is 140500 In 2022, it was 129500 In 2021, it was 102000 As stated earlier, it was a multiple property purchase, um, so we deem that invalid. Uh, non arms league transaction. Uh, we did a five comp report, um, and that median was one hundred and sixty-two thousand three hundred and sixty-seven dollars. The square footage is one thousand one hundred and thirty-six square feet, and that would give you a price per square foot of one hundred and twenty-three dollars and sixty-eight cents. Okay. That it? Yes, that's all I have. All right, anything in response, Ms. Galinda? Nope. All right, I'm going to close the hearing on uh, BOE number 106 and open up the hearing on BOE number R number 108, which is account number ending in 1170-1170. This is a property of 4065 Northwest 60th Street in Oklahoma City. Uh, the assessor has this property at 191500 and you're asking, the taxpayer is asking 175800 am I right? Yes. Okay. Tell us what you want us to know about this property. This was also a multi-parcel sale. Um, this is the $6 million uh, one that we had heard yesterday that there was uh, how many were are there? I'll tell you now. Sorry. It was in March of 22. Um, it was multi parcel, and there were, I think this was like 35. Yep, 35 parcels. Okay. For 6,381,500, um, based off of what our client provided, the state believes it was the purchase price. Um, for this particular property in regards to the whole portfolio. Um, that is what we are basing it off of. All right, anything else? Nope, that's all. All right, then now uh, we'll hear from the assessor. Okay. Um, this one is located uh, off of Tulsa Avenue in Northwest 50th. And as she stated, she brought up an older sale. Uh, so this one actually sold twice in 2022. Um, there was one in March, as she stated, and then there was another one in July um, for $1,174,000. And there were yeah, three accounts, or three properties in that sale in July. $1,744,000? Uh, one, one, yeah. One million one seven four thousand. Oh, okay. Uh, 
we currently have it, as you stated earlier, 191,500. In 2022, it was 179,500. In 2021, it was 163,000. Uh, we did a six comp report, um, and that median was $215,143. The square footage of this property is 1,459 square feet. And that would give you a price per square foot of $131.25. Okay, and that is all I have. All right. Anything for response, Ms. Belinda? Nope, no response. Okay, I'm going to close the hearing on BOE number 108. Open up the hearing on BOE 109, which is number three on our docket, and uh, that's account number ending in 3080. It is 116. 16 Wallace Avenue in Oklahoma City. Uh, the assessor has assessed this property at 156000 The taxpayer is asking for 140000 I think there's 1,152 square feet uh, in this property. And this, of course, is a rental. Uh, and you still don't have any rent information. Am I right? No. Okay. Nope. All right. Well, let's tell us what you want us to know about this property. So this was also a multi-parcel sale, um, not part of any of the ones that we've already discussed. So just an FYI. <laughs> okay. Um, it sold in April of 2022 for $1,513,000. Um, there were seven parcels that were attached to this um, that was included in this. We based it based off of what our client noted as what the purchase price for this particular property was. Okay. Uh, your client then. Yes. Uh, and, and a million. They bought a portfolio. They, they decided on how much each one was. Not sure exactly the calculation if they did a price per square foot or they just. I'm, I'm not 100% sure. I wish I had more information. It is pretty horrible to be saying all these things in front of a hearing. Um, but it's kind of what was given to me, and that's what I have to say. <laughs> okay. Well, I get the average, the average of these seven properties is like 206, a little over 216000 So uh, yeah. I mean, maybe some of the others are more expensive. Okay, uh, anything else you want to tell us right now? No, that's all. Okay, we'll hear from the assessor. Okay. Uh, the major streets of this property are going to be uh, Council and Northwest 122nd Street. Oh. Uh, current value is 156000 In 2022, we had it for 138500 In 2021, we had it on for 126000 We do to, or we used a six comp report, and that median was one hundred and sixty three thousand seven hundred and ninety dollars. <coughs> the square footage is um, one thousand one hundred and fifty two square feet, and that would give you a price per square foot of one hundred and thirty five dollars and forty two cents. No, sir. <coughs> All right, Ms. Belinda, any response? No response. Okay, I'm going to close the hearing on DOE number 109. That brings us to the last one on the docket this <coughs> DOE 116, which is account number ending in 1380. Uh, it's a property at 6813 North 29 Street in Bethany. Uh, the assessor has assessed this property at 191000 and the taxpayer is asking uh, for 170000 It's 1,802 square feet. All right. Uh, tell us what you want us to know about this property, Mr. Linda. 
we agree with the assessment that was created uh, from the, the PA, so we're going to withdraw this one. Oh, okay. So we have an agreement that uh, <coughs> this property is uh, valued at a hundred and ninety-one thousand, even. Correct. Okay. Do I need a motion? Yeah, we need a motion. Um, I move that we set the value as agreed by the parties with no objection to BOE number one sixteen at one hundred and ninety-one thousand. Second. All those in favor? Aye. 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 <laughs> All right. Uh, that concludes the docket for this morning, Ms. Galinda. Uh, Thank you. Looks like you. Uh, At least I hope I've been ever entertaining. Well, uh, uh, hey, yeah, I said, have, have you ever been to Oklahoma? No. Oh, have you been to Oklahoma? And have you hit 100 degrees yet? Um, no, I think we were at 93 okay. yesterday, but no, it's, I, I mean, how, if you really get that hot over there? <laughs> 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 yeah, it's, yes. Yeah, and humidity. Humidity is just horrible until about July, then it kind of dries the air out with 100 and something plus temperature. Uh, but, but you guys see more different seasons over there, yeah, right? Yeah. Yeah. Every day. <laughs> yep. <laughs> old saying is, if you don't like the weather, wait till tomorrow. Okay. Hey, so is there something that's super fun to do in Oklahoma City? Like, is there something that you absolutely have to do when you go visit? Well, we got rafting. We've developed our river, so you can do all kinds of things on the river, and we are even a... Uh, preliminary qualifying round of some of the Olympic stuff. Wow! Yeah, the uh, yeah that National Cowboy Museum. Yeah, we yeah. got the National Cowboy Hall of Fame. Memorial. And we, we've got the Murrah Building site where uh, those numb skulls killed all those people. Uh, we have Native American Museum. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. That's sat huh. there for a long so, time. Yeah. So you're saying I should go over there and visit? Well, it wouldn't hurt. <laughs> uh, yeah. Yeah, you, we don't have as many old people as you all do. <laughs> oh my God. The old pe and the way that they drive. We <laughs> have youngins or well. really old people who drive so slow. Of course, if, never in the middle. if you come to visit the county building here, you might uh, <laughs> you might run into a few of yeah. Well, if you, uh, if you come to Oklahoma, you're not going to have the uh, old people drive slow. They're going to be blowing your doors off. <laughs> so, oh, wow. <laughs> Even that, uh, the, the posted speed limit, which I drive all the time. Sometimes I drive more than that, but uh, people pass me just zinging along. But anyway, uh, yeah, we'd, be, uh, we'd welcome you to come. Uh, so are you going to be back on um, Thursday? I am, it's, and then uh, I think next week as well. I also am I here so. there. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Yep. Yeah. yeah. All right. All right. Yeah, well, I recommend coming to Oklahoma in October. <laughs> and it's kind of, yes. yeah. kind of nice here. Come to an OU game. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay, good. October. I'll be sure to plan it. <laughs> All right. All right. Miss right. Galinda, it's been a pleasure speaking with you and uh, appreciate your input. We'll uh, be talking what? to you tomorrow. Or Thursday. 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 I'm sorry. Yep. We're not not tomorrow. Thursday. Thursday. It's okay. Thursday. I'll, I'll talk to you Thursday. Thank you. Thank you. Right. Are we good? Okay. Yes, I did. I did want to ask you all about something. So on the second item, I want to make sure we have the address right. Is that 4065 Northwest 60th or is it 50th? I got 60th. I got 60th. Because the taxpayer's form says 60th, but I feel like I heard you say 50th. And I don't know. It's 60th. It's 60th, okay. Yeah, that the might... major street was 50th. Gotcha, okay. Just yes. want to make sure. Okay, yes. perfect. And I do have a question. Is there absolutely no way to ever have a bulk valid sale? What, what, what if you had uh, three houses that you knew were worth a million dollars and you paid three million dollars? Would you... Is it just not going to be valid because it was bulk? 
even though the price kind of fits. In commercial, that could be a valid sale. If they're, like you said, three buildings, right. and the, you know they're a million dollars each, you right. want to make it easier and do it on one sale. Yeah, they'd yeah. have to be almost identical. Yeah, uh, correct. Yeah. Yes. Good question. I don't know the answer to. And these are not identical because we had a swing from eleven to seventeen hundred square feet, so yeah. mm -hmm. I could see that. But I just want how much money do these people have that they can sit <laughs> up <laughs> and buy three? Well, I mean, well, we're still a record. Uh, well, Sorry. Well, that's a legitimate question. <laughs> it is a good question. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So the reason I'm rent went up. Red. Yeah. Z folks. Yeah, do you I will ask that question. Do you guys look up rent for for a rental on any of these? We asked for it and they still didn't provide it for us right. and we couldn't find it anywhere. Okay. So we we tried everything to get any kind of information and we got zilch. Okay. Well so I, I'm glad that Mercy at least realizes that. Yes. Because we've definitely had representatives in the past that hadn't been as sympathetic toward that. Right, so, and I understand yeah. the ramifications of yeah. not providing. Okay. All right, so I move that we adjourn. Second. All those in favor, aye. Aye. Okay. Yeah, and it's, it's the rent <coughs> shot up. It's not just oh, these, sorry, it's all right. but uh, corporations that come in and just gathered up all these properties. Yeah. Uh, sheriff sales and all